Hello everyone, Rick here from Virus Nation. Today I'm doing a uh, how you build a security lab or virus server. So these are all the parts you need. Mostly times two except this bit over here. That bit that's just there. So uh, take a good look. So let's begin with building. So I'm just gonna start off with the legs. So get one of these, uh, these big feet, and hey, <coughs> plop one of these in there. Smallest bone piece, uh, upper leg piece, one with. Now another upper leg piece with two pinholes and another small one. Then we're gonna add this here. This one is the is a I think it's a type four type four armor plate with in gunmetal gray. One a type 5 armor plate, another type 5 armor plate which goes on like this. Now you have one leg uh, out of the four. Everything is, is you have to make everything two times, one time mirror it. So just remember that when you're building this. Um, one of these feet and a regular boom piece. Another regular bone piece and one of those bone, upper bone pieces with two pinholes. Then gunmetal grey type 4. Uh, yellow type yellow type 3. And uh, type 5 with this print. The evo print. And then put that on the side. And then grab uh, the second largest body and just this one on one of the leg parts and the longer leg on the middle ball joint. And then give the middle leg this double bend like this. If you hear the annoying sound, my dad is taking a bath. Okay. Then pull this as far back as it will go. And the second bone piece as well, and then everything down and stretched out, so you have this monstrosity. Then we're gonna add the arm, so bone, upper bone piece with two holes, lower bone pe lower leg piece with one hole. Then add one with the um, combat machine printing of type 5. A yellow type 5 and then grab one of these I don't know what they're called place a axle in there and another axle in on the other side so you have this then add one of these on each axle I don't know if you can see this it's uh, pushing with two bars on each side. And then add the large uh, uh, claws in gunmetal grey. Same on the other side. Just E eh and E. Eh. So you have this claw. And then put that on the bottom of the construction you just made. And put that on the outside of your mech and then you should have this next add oh, the no. type 5 black bone piece here the shortest or uh, arm piece here shortest bone piece on this part and type 4 armor piece in black on that put that up to the side again then for the cockpit just Assemble the cockpit which says 
Raka or any other minifigure you want to put in there. I think these are the Exoforce arms. Put those on there like this. On both sides. Put the minifigure in the seat, arms folded down. Make sure the legs are folded all the way down, otherwise it won't close properly. Fold the control sticks over to the hands of the minifigure and close the cockpit. This is why you have, have to have the legs all the way down, otherwise the cockpit won't close. Then grab one of these ball socket to ball socket the connections with the ball joint in the middle. Put it on there like this. Make sure you haven't you don't have it turned the other way around, otherwise it can't fit on here. So then you take the shoulder ball joint off one of these and just place it on there and fold it down. Look, that's coming together quite nicely. Have you heard the news what? about the bird? Sorry, we had a little, little bit of interference. So now you should have this. Um, oh my god. Place these two friction adders. One on the arm and one on the leg. Ball joints. <laughs> like this, just make them face outwards. Then, we're going to work on the wing and the gun. So take the smallest body and put a Type 5 yellow armor piece on the back. Then on the part where the head's supposed to go, place two of the smallest ball joints. Then put that off to the side. Again, make the same construction you made for the hand with one of these and two axles. Place one of these special uh, uh, gun parts on top. Like, like this. And a smaller one in gunmetal gray on the bottom. And then put that on the construction you just built and grab a ball joint and, or, or not a ball joint uh, a ball and put it in there a ball then, two ball and then make it look like this then grab two of these upper upper limb uh, limb uh, bone pieces it's partially done Nice. Two lower leg. Okay. Oh my god, who the hell cares? Shut up. Thank you. Okay, so then you have this. Um, put them together with one of these ball socket to ball socket bone pieces with a ball joint in the middle. Then you should have this. On the lower limb pieces, put, I think, yeah, put two yellow type 5 armor pieces. We're almost done, just bear with me, you should have this. Then a lower limb bone piece, the small uh, type 3 uh, armor part on there in yellow. One of these parts here, a frictionless half pin and half axle, and a saw blade. And then you should be done for this part. So then we have to do the final pieces. So you need to take three of these, uh, these ball socket to ball sockets. On one of them you place this... Um, this, um, this the biggest bone piece without a ball socket in the middle and put it in the middle ball joint then put the stormer type 5 armor piece on there and make sure it looks like this and uh, then do the same but with two ball socket to ball socket parts 
then make another cockpit like I just showed you with only with an orange and a, and a black cockpit. And again, two gunmetal gray Exoforce arms. A uh, hero factory minifigure of your choice. I chose Evo because it's Evo. It, it's this guy's mech. Place that on the construction that we made before, and then we can put it all together. So, you, and by the way, I already told you, but you need to mirror, mirror everything except for these these things. So, getting everything together first, take this part with the gun, and let me just take a little peek on the as low as it can with alt with both pins in the body. Put one of these in there, just like this. Then attach the saw blade like this on each arm. Then take your mech and put that as high as it will go on the back. And um, then take the secondary cockpit you made and just and just put it on the, the top there. Put the other piece on the bottom. Then get the sides you just mirrored like yeah, just exactly the same except with Stormer instead of Rocca. Just fold the legs correctly. Saw it out like this. And place that there and there. Just get it situated straight. Place them that down. A little, little bit further back. Play, do this, fold this over the legs. And I think that there we have the Goliath mech in its robot mode. Oh yeah, also fold these parts just like this. I already showed this in the other video. So if you want to transform him, just go watch the actual review. If anyone has any questions on how to transform him, I will do uh, just a specific video on it. Ah, oh, damn it. That was fucked.